Hey guys, this is Kendra Burns, Traveling as Talking Forests, getting ready to go from Germany, Frankfurt Airport, to Edinburgh, Scotland. I really wish I could have flown out yesterday, although there was a storm over the Great Britain area, and so I was not able to fly out. As you can see, I am in a lovely hotel room. What happened was my husband and dog Rhett, we went to go to the airport seven in the morning and get me on a flight. I basically went in with my luggage and went to go check in my check-in luggage. The moment I got in line, I looked at my app, Lufthansa said canceled. It's the first time this has ever happened to me. I haven't really been traveling very much. This is all new to me. So I, as you can tell, probably went into a little bit of a panic. But the first thing I did was I went to Lufthansa customer service and asked them what they could do for me. However, I knew that I had insurance. That was a good reassurance. It was very affordable. It was about 30 euro added onto my plane ticket to Edinburgh. So I'm lucky that I had that because what happened was I immediately had the opportunity to get free voucher for hotel, free voucher for meals in the airport and here at the hotel. So I'm really happy that that happened and that they were able to do that. Some of the caveats, I was not able to check into my hotel until around 3 p.m. That had to be a shuttle because it's away from the airport. So I shuttled to this hotel yesterday around 3. And it, it's okay. It's a good hotel. It hasn't been, you know, scary until the fire alarm went off when I was trying to nap right before dinner. Um, that experience was new to me and waking up from a deep sleep to an alarm was scary. <laughs> but it just... You know, anything can happen. So I was ready, we all went outside, and then after that, the Führer Wehr firefighters from Germany came in and disarmed the alarm, and I went and sat down and had the buffet dinner, and it was pretty good. And I got to talk to some Scottish folks that were at dinner next to me, um, so that was delightful, and I had a good time. So I'm trying to check out in, mm, I have eight minutes, I'll have to go check out. So I'm gonna show you guys a quick tour of this hotel room and what I use to travel with since I've been saying that I will do that. Um, I travel as light as I possibly can and I also travel with reusable things because I don't want to throw away single use items like straws and utensils and plastic. I am very against that. So I have a few items that I'm taking with me and I'm gonna show you guys. So I take a few items here. I have the reusable spoon and fork thingy-majig. And so what I do is if it's not a finger food item or if it's one of those um, eateries where you can go get your own silverware, well, I just pull this out of my purse and use it and then I wash it. So I, I wash it afterwards. Um, rinse it off afterwards. So this has been really handy anywhere I go. I don't have to throw away single-use utensils. And then I always have a reusable bag. So I got this at a drugstore in Germany somewhere and it just, we always have it. It even, you know, is handy when my husband and I are out and we need it. So I use that as well. And then I have a little setup here. Uh, these are for the European 220 to 110. Um, I, I am from America, so I have a lot of 110 items, and I bring about three of these with me just to charge everything and, you know, keep everyone <laughs> happy and everything charged so I can do this, so I can vlog. Um, and it's really exciting. So I have these for Europe um, whenever we go. And then there are times where I have to ground myself, so I use a lot of um, oils. And that's my little oil kit. That's the purse I travel with. And then let's go to my backpack. It's a really old backpack, you guys. I got it like as an intern eight years ago, but whatever, my, my husband says we need to replace it. I agree with him. That'll be for another time. So um, I travel with a water bottle and I bring this everywhere with me even in the hotel I bring it to dinner bring it to lunch and it really is good because unfortunately the German style is to have like a few centiliters of 
of liquid, like a little tiny size of your hand kids cup, and it just doesn't work when you're when you're very parched and you're you're super thirsty. So um, I can chug water anytime I want, and I love getting stickers from all around the world. And I have some room on this one from the Scot the Scottish stickers that I get, so I'm excited for that. Um, as well, I have been traveling with a coffee, reusable coffee container, so I can just rinse this out real quick and I can use it as many times as I want and it doesn't get thrown away, so that way we don't, re we don't continue throwing away single-use items. Um, so if I'm ever wanting tea or coffee, I just ask for it in this container and we wash it out. So let's go to, so this is the hotel room. It's not too bad. Nice little TV there. And now we're gonna go into the bathroom. So this is the main entryway and the bathroom here. There's some mirrors. And so I travel with bar soap and I use it for everything. And I also have a separate shampoo bar um, to use for my hair. And I've been using that shampoo bar for travel for months. So even when I went to California and stayed in Yosemite and then Kentucky, I stayed in Louisville. And so it's been able to travel with me and it looks tiny. So I'll show you guys. This little thing will last months. And it is on my hair all the time. And it's really, really cool because you just put it in your hair and then it suds up a little bit and you just use that to wash your hair. So it's completely reusable and look how tiny it is. It's easy to travel with. So I really recommend anyone to get shampoo bars and then just bars of soap. So that's what I use here. I use it in a little travel mug. So, and this is like made of wood fiber. So I really like that, of course. Um, and this is uh, for my earrings. So it's a really reusable pouch and this is my makeup. So I don't wear very much makeup at all. So if you can see my face here, yeah, I probably have some blemishes and I don't use like moisturizer very often or I don't, I don't even own foundation, you guys. Um, I cleanse my face when I need to. I know I probably should when I get in. I do wash my face with soap. Um, but yeah, I only have mascara eyeliner and I just got this palette. This is the first new eyeshadow I've bought since I moved to Germany. So I'm a, a basic girl, you guys. So you don't need much when you travel and it's really easy. So I hope you all have a great day and this is my first vlog. I'm going to try to get to Scotland today. Tschüss!